was about 10 hours of normal imaging. So we're going to have a closer look now to show you what you can get with this kit. Right, got the box here. Now, I know this is German, uh, but have a look. Some places like Alfred's or places like Maplin's in UK that probably might be able to sell some of these and um, again I'm not joking it does power your car you know starts it up so it's really that clever uh, I wouldn't believe uh, the specifications on it but you know you can charge up uh, your mobile phone you can run DVDs uh, computer and even the camera and all that However, I'm going to use it just to power uh, my CCD, uh, just for the cooling only. But when I wait for my uh, my other one, my 15 amps per hour, that's going to be used to run the the mount. But um, again, smart smart little package. It cost around cost me 99 euros. All right, which works out around about 80 quid. But believe me, 80 quid you can't really grumble. Really, and basic open it up. Also, I've, I've rearranged anyway. But you get, you know, your your, your bog standard manual. You get your yeah warranty and all that. But inside, it's all packaged. Um, you've got your AC. Also, you've got your AC power lead to charge it up. All right, so you can charge it up. Then you've got the bat uh, battery itself. All right, we'll have a look on the battery. All right, again, that's the port where you connect uh, your crocodile clips for your car, and the crocodile clips are here. All right, so that's where that goes. All right, uh, this port here is basically the port to power your laptop. These bits here is your battery status. And that's the on button to switch on uh, your USB or the battery itself. There's a USB 2 port. Uh, travel, uh, its output is maximum is 5 volts and 2 amps. Uh, this is the output. This is the one I'm going to use the most. This is the 12 volt 2 amp uh, socket, which I would use to power my mount and my CCD, my Orion Star shoot. All right, so within those power regulations and this will be powered by this uh, lead here which is an AC port with a 2.1 millimeter um, AC power socket so and then here's the port to charge it up all right so again it's very smart very smart little device and it's even got a light as well you know there's a charge, you know, it tells you display on there, uh, all the lights lighting up, and then you've got your... Alright, and even the light works, it's quite a bright light, it's actually an allergen light, alright, and it flashes as well, if you want that kind of stuff, you want to have a bit of a rave party going on, but... Uh... So yeah, it's quite a clever little device. All right, and I do like this charging uh, battery status on there as well. So you got the charger as well to charge it up. Um, there's even a socket, um, so you can actually connect it to a car and charge it up that way. It's pretty smart as well. Then you've got your crocodile leads in here, crocodile leads, and all your sockets there, all the little um, for the normal AC uh, adapters. And then there's even little attachments for your USB for your mobile phone chargers, right? So you can actually use it as a mobile phone charger or any other stuff as well. So there you go. I mean, you won't believe this is 12 amps per hour for this sort of size. Uh, but believe me, I thought it's money well spent. You know, 99 euros and you've got all this kit. Yeah, you know, lithium ion battery. Um, I can't, I can't really grumble at that. I mean, it's a portable device as it is, and it's better to carry uh, this than carry my my power tanks, which some 
ones are 17 amps per hour and I've got another one that's 7 amps per hour but they're big and bulky and then worse still I even got 40 amps per hour one which is basically a, a, a deep cycle car battery all right, and I use that for my QHY 8L and uh, QHY uh, 9CC, you know, CCDs. Uh, but it's the trouble is though, they're too heavy, they're too bulky to carry around. But for for my portable device, um, get get yourself one of these to travel around with because you've got loads of plenty of power in this. And it's all right to go and take this on a plane or not because it's a sealed unit, it's protected, and you shouldn't have any dramas. And the good thing is, you know, it looks pretty smart as well. I like the mint white, really goes a treat down the treat with that. So, um, I hope this has helped you guys expand your ideas. All right, uh, please feel free to comment on this particular guide. Um, Thanks again for um, watching and I uh, hope you have clear skies.